Hello family, welcome again on our channel. Here we are in Devon, Port Aba, where all the Japanese cars used to land. Guys, we're coming here to show all our subscribers from uh, Zimbabwe, from Botswana, Namibia, Mozambique, Zambia, everywhere around South Africa, where they used to come and buy Japanese cars. That over here, we have thousands of Japanese cars that are coming here every day. But the reality is that the customers are not that much. It's just few customers. So today I decided to take you to one of the biggest yard of the Japanese cars, where they load in the cars, where the cars are coming directly from the port and they're keeping them there where you can go and buy it. I know that this place here, some people will ask me for the location of the place. First, first of all, before I can go, I would like to give you the location of this place here. This is the former Mahatma Gandhi Road. No, they, they call it today Mahatma Gandhi, but it was first called Point Road, the former Point Road. If you know Deben, you're heading to reach Oshaka. Before you reach Oshaka, there is a place there on your left where there is a, a roundabout before you reach Oshaka. Right on your right side, you will see there is a big boat there where they wrote Japan import, Japan import, uh, ex import, yeah. You will see them, it's written like that, Japan import. There is a lot of cars. It was also my first time to visit this place here. I found out that there is a lot of Japanese cars inside of this place here. All the cars you're looking, you can find it here. The Jeep, the, 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 the fancy cars, the luxury cars, whatever cars you need, you will get it here. They got a lot of cars and the price of the Japanese are still the same. They are not that expensive. As I told you that these cars is not expensive since they are not allowed to drive in South Africa. They just sell it cheaper. It's up to you to negotiate. When you know how to negotiate, you can get these cars very cheap. Like this Golf here, you can ask it and they will tell you the price is 3,000 US dollars or 3.5 thousand US dollars. Mm -hmm. If you put the 3.5 uh, thousand US dollars, it's something like 55,000 rand. It's something like 55,000 rand you can get this golf. This Mercedes can go to 3,000 US dollars, which is about sometime like uh, maybe 50,000 or 52,000, it depends. So guys, don't be afraid. I, as I always told you, some of the Japanese cars, they don't put the price directly on the windshield because they know when you will come here, you're going to negotiate it. So they will give you the price and you will mm, give them your the price so you can talk. But today, I came Not just much, to eh? show you this yard. You it got it. a lot of Ooh, Japanese cars and it's also big. Well. It got a lot of VW. Oh, no. It got a... Uh, to be a lot of Mazda, especially the Mazda. I saw a lot of Mazdas. I saw the, 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 the Toyotas, that is like uh, the Japanese Toyotas. You will see they got the same engine with the Toyotas, but the design look a little bit funny with the uh, with Toyota oh, here in too South much Africa. And Mazdas. But it's the same cars, and there is a lot of cars that are lying here with no customers, almost no customers. So guys, if you're from Zimbabwe, from this Japan, the only uh, what be from uh, the only BM from Mozambique, if you're from uh, Namibia, you from uh, Lesotho or wherever else, guys, you can go there and get the cars very cheap. Sometimes in our countries, these cars are very expensive. They sell it expensive because the same people are coming to buy it here X, X1, and they go and double the price that side in your country. X1. The only thing that will cost you here, you will buy this car cheap. Like this BM, you can buy it maybe 60,000 in rent, and in US dollars, you can buy it maybe in 3,000 or 3.5 thousand, and plus maybe you will spend another maybe 15,000 rent to, to, to get the carrier that will lift the car from uh, the place you buy it up to the border. You can spend yeah, maybe 15,000 uh, or maybe 10,000. Tomorrow, it Saturday, will depend you open. on the people who will you carry your car because it's all negotiable so guys one. we don't have to say a lot oh, just okay. watch the beautiful japanese cars that are here you will see all the big toyotas the prados and so on so 
the only thing we ask you guys Today subscribe on closing? our channel like our video five we will show you more cars and we wish that the next yard we're going to go through we will get you all the price and we will tell the people to write us the price so we can just also publish it and you can be seeing the price one time because some of these cars just came like some two days ago they have not put any price on the windshield and they're not even willing to put the price on the windshield These until you like yourself will eh? come and they will, you, you choose a car then they're gonna give you the price and you give ah, them your to, price and you Toyota. discuss but look at this Toyota. Luxious. It look funny. Luxious. Look at, okay. but it's a Toyota. Yeah, it's this a one Japanese is just Toyota. A Toyota. You Toyota. can see the design. It's just the same yeah, design with the Toyota here. Yeah. But yeah. there is some small difference. But they are all Toyotas. A lot of them are here. The Japanese cars that are cheap. Like these Toyotas here, you can get them maybe 1.5 thousand. No, what? Uh, 1.5 thousand US dollars. So which is something like 20,000 rand, you can get these Toyotas. Or sometimes it's 2,000 or 1,800 uh, uh, 1, 1. Uh, US dollars, which is about like 25 or 30,000 rand, you get these Toyotas. These You're going to spend eh? maybe 10,000 rand to carry eh? it to your country. So guys, mm. it's very cheap, trust me. As I'm asking the price, they're giving me the price directly, but when you come here, you ask your price, they will also give you the price. And these people here can also play a trick with you. When they see you, they see your body language, your behavior. If they know that this man may have a lot of money, they can also give you an expensive price. That they know that maybe you won't be able to, to negotiate it and you can also pay them directly. But if you know how to negotiate, whatever price they will give you, just tell them what you have. And then they will, you will start discussing it with them and you'll get the car. From here in Deben, a Japanese car, car are, they are very, very cheap. A Japanese cars in Deben are cheap. You just gonna prepare some money also to, 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 to put the car on the carrier to take it to your country of origin. That will make it a little bit expensive, but not that expensive. The way you buy it directly in Botswana or the way you will buy it in Mozambique or in Swaziland or in uh, in Zimbabwe. Here, if you buy it, you're gonna buy it first of all, you'll buy the car very cheap. Then, if you put the price of the carrier, then it's gonna make it a little bit higher, but not that much expensive the way you can buy it in Zimbabwe or the way you can buy it in Zambia. So guys, welcome on our channel. Subscribe, like our video, and you won't miss out any of our video. Watch this video. There is a lot of Japanese cars, beautiful cars, that you're going to like the most and share the video leave a comment if you can be part of this family and we welcome you if it's your first time please subscribe if you are already member of our family we welcome you and stay tuned until we post the next video bye
Sorry, I can be getting the price and can I send this video to a guy? Tell me which one I can ask the prices.
Let me check first.
Thank you. 